when it is cold outside, problems can find their way inside your home. We're talking to Metro plumbers say their phones are ringing off the hook. Homeowners are also trying to keep their homes warm without breaking the bank. Fox 4 Sean McDowell with more on how to keep your home stay warm and secure. It is the simplest of all solutions for homeowners when it gets this cold outside. Plumbing experts at companies like Kansas City's AB May answer dozens of calls per day from homeowners who say pipes have burst inside their home and now they've got a water emergency. The simplest solution, they say, keep the faucets at your sink at a slow drip. That's the smartest first step. I would just bring it to a slow trickle. Tony Belzer, one of AB May's installation plumbers, demonstrates how it doesn't take much of a flow to keep water moving through pipes, which can prevent them from breaking in the cold. We like to leave the faucet dripping. Um, to you know, alleviate that pressure buildup. The average service call to repair a burst water pipe can cost a homeowner as much as $1,000. AB May has eight repair techs on call this weekend for pipe problem calls. Belzer also recommends leaving cabinet doors near water pipes open, and safe use of a space heater is also a good idea. I think being proactive about the situation is the best you know, um, to prevent anything from happening in your house. Keeping the entire house warm is a priority given temperatures that will likely fall below zero this weekend. What we like to say is to keep warm, not hot. Dawn Tripp speaks for Kansas Gas Service. She says there's no magical number or predetermined temperature that will keep a house warm in an All energy right? efficient okay. way. Kansas Gas recommends use of their average payment plan, which can ease the strain of higher utility costs in the winter, but keeping your home free of drafts is smart. You may have an elderly uh, family member. You may have an infant or someone who has some health concerns. And keep your home warm, but not hot. As far as plumbing goes and sinks that are out of the way in your home, maybe in a garage or a shed someplace, Belzer recommends the smart play for the time being might be to shut the water off there completely to avoid burst pipes and turning it back on when the weather gets better. Sean McDowell, Fox 4, working for you.